Bum 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 bum. Tomatoes. Hello, welcome to the video for what is Cheat Manager, the slow mo node. The slow mo node is pretty simple. It basically modifies time dilation and slows or speeds up the game. Let me show you this in an example. Here's my character. He can run around normally, no problems. Now in my cheat menu, I hit slow mo, and now we're running down at roughly a tenth of the normal speed. If I hit slow mo again, it's going to set me back to one or normal speed. Slow mo node is pretty simple. It takes in the cheat manager as our input and then a float, which is our time dilation. One is normal time dilation. Assuming you haven't changed it anywhere else, one is going to be normal speed. The lower the number, the slower it goes. The higher the number, the faster it goes. So for example, I could change this to two and hit play. I'll hit slow-mo and we now are running twice as fast. Now when I say running twice as fast, it's not just what we see on the screen. It's just not my character, for example, running slower or faster. This affects the time dilation of the game, which means everything will run slower or faster. So ticks and things like that. Anything not Anything that is affected by our global time dilation is changed. And that's it. That is our slow-mo node. It's really nice and simple. If you want to maybe even pause the game, but still have certain things running by just adjusting our time dilation down to something even small. So for example, zero one and hitting play. If we hit slow-mo, you'll notice that my character itself, my camera still works, my mouse still works, but my character is pretty much frozen and all activities in the game are still frozen. We can hit slow-mo again. Since I'm flipping, it just sets it back to one.